Izzy, tell them what you're making for dinner today. I'm making a Hawaiian fruit salad. <laughs> so she's gonna start cutting everything up. Yeah. And next door to her is Noah, who's getting his stuff prepped. Hmm. We are Luke and Heather Bell, and we have eight children. Seven of them we adopted, and this is just the Bell's 10. All right, I have you on, sister. Go ahead. So she's gonna get all her fruit going. Did you get a strainer for that? What's up, sister? <sighs> So it calls for um, strawberries, uh, mandarin Cucumbers. oranges. Honey, you're supposed to strain them out. We're gonna keep it soaking in the juice so it doesn't dry out. Like my Five eyes. Minute crash, actually. Okay, I'll take care of that. You got your cream I just cheese. had to steer her in the direction of how to do. <laughs> okay, Brent, your burner's not going, Bren or Noah. I don't know how you expect to cook that pulled pork with your, yeah. Here, let's just go over here. My kid is prepping the dinner. And um, your burner's not going, so how do you expect the pulled pork to heat up? Just putting the chicken away. Oh, you are, okay. Yeah. <laughs> you need to leave. One more day of school and they're done. Okay, so. Now I get to get on my mom's He's gonna do all his prep work and then um, ah, show us how to do it. Yeah, that's beautiful. So they have one more day of work. Okay, while she's prepping those mangoes, let's uh, let's do over here. We might get two videos Use on the one. Use the claw grip. All right, so he's gonna heat up his pulled pork that we already cooked. He's gone now. I'm just gonna go back and forth like this. You guys are gonna get two recipes in one. All right, Izzy's getting her mangoes ready to go. Don't worry, guys. I'm still on the first one. See, I put it all in one bag. Do you want Noah to help you? You guys want to work together on all of it? No. Noah could be cutting strawberries and kiwis while you're doing that. No? No. Okay, I'm just trying to make you guys' life a little lighter. So she's going to mix. Um, so the sauce is the creamer, cheesecake, and cream cheese. Hey, my burner's actually good. And then Noah, so you need to one down. Do you want me to give you extra, like different bowls? Why can't I just cut these and then like cut the inside and take a spoon and just scoop out the cubes? Whatever you want. Yeah, it's whatever you want, honey. We just need to get them cut. Anybody else thirsty? Ever seen any someone on camera cut their hand open? You're about to today. No, we're not. Okay, let's go over here. You don't look like you're, you're getting much done. So you need to get your onions grilled. Yeah, really. You need to get your onions grilled, right? This is good. Get your onions grilled. You want, might want to do so a half a stick of butter, your onions, and then you can put a little garlic in it. You can get the, you can get the onions going at the same time too, bud. Yeah, bud. Let this not burn. Watch this butter melt. All right, go for it. So put your butter in. That is popping. That's okay. Butter. I wish Cardi B was and my best And now your friend. onions that you already chopped up or sliced. And then do you want to put some garlic in them? Or are you going to... Whoa, whoa, whoa. You might make it. And then as you cook them, they will get smaller. Correct. You got your pork cooking. There you go. Not as Are you going to put garlic in those onions or no? Yes, yeah. I'm going to put garlic in this. Shh, don't take my thing. Why, are you hiding something over there? Mm-hmm. Perfect. All right, so get both of those cooking. While those are cooking, you can start prepping. Well, just get those cooking first, and we're going to get Izzy going here. Ah, shop here Camera's shop here, coming back. Here. Camera's coming back, and she's eating her product. <laughs> okay. So what what kind of knife do you want? A sharp one. The one that will work with me. Like small or big? Okie dokie. So she's finishing up her mangoes. And um, honey, you need to put the put your cookie sheets over here on the stove there. So we'll finish her getting her mango cut. And Noah's getting his stuff done. Honey, you don't have to do that. Watch. I can't see anything. Whoa. It came out. All 
All right, go ahead. You can start. We can do that. We'll do the dessert one after. Go ahead. You can do it. Just boy. really watch what oh, you're boy, doing. Oh boy. You're pretty good about... Perfect. That's probably going to be the hardest one. And the kiwi. Do you want me to start peeling the kiwi for you or you want to do it? I'm not going to peel. I'm cutting it in half, scooping it out with the spoon, just cutting it. Oh, perfect. Okay, perfect. Okay. All right. All right. So is that almost done? It just has to be pulled apart. I think, I'd say if it's separated, you're good on the pulled pork. We actually made this a while ago. We um, smoked it. There's no seasoning on it. Just maybe a little bit, but for the most part, it's just smoked in applewood smoke. That's pretty good. I'm yeah, that's perfect. So just push that up to the front, to the top, and check on your onions. Maybe stir them around a little bit. They look like ogres. They look like what? Ogres. Ogres. All right, perfect. Beautiful. I can go a little more closer to you. All right. Okay, so I would, that probably looks good. I would um, maybe, yeah, spread it out a little bit to the edges. Perfect. You actually cut that really good. I just need to, yeah, if you need to put a little bit more on the edges, go ahead. And get the top. Yeah, see the top? Right up there, see the corners, honey? Mm -hmm. The rest of it looks good. I would just get the corners. Izzy's working on strawberries over there. Here, real fast, I'm going to show them. Okay, she's mass producing strawberries right here. Now she's just got to cut them. And, uh. Looks like jelly. Put them in. Okay. So the next thing it says on your list pork. is pork. So you have some tongs right there. You can switch the onions and the pork if you want. I mean, or just move the onions over. Yeah, there you go. Perfect. All right, so now you're going to put, put a really decent, generous heaping of pork. I mean, you don't want it too much, I guess, but. There you go. So next is the pork. Oops, sorry. And here's Izzy getting her done with the strawberries. And after she gets done with that, she's gonna make her sauce. And hers is actually gonna be really fast. All right, there we go. Yeah, so go ahead and get all that nice. You don't have to come super small, but I guess fours is, yeah, fours is perfect. Is that what you're doing is fours? Yeah. Okay, perfect. It's gonna get eaten anyways. All right, how's that going? Ooh, that looks beautiful. Okay, just put a couple more on there. beautiful all right and then it says the next thing on your list is onions. your onions onions so what do i do with the onions you go ahead and put a layer of onions on there yeah just like that because it's gonna have to cook in the oven a little bit too so just spread them out real nice you don't want them super thick if you have extras it's okay we can eat them for something else yeah yeah that's perfect so maybe spread them out down at the bottom too yeah you don't want them super thick i mean i don't know i like grilled onions but I'm sure everybody else. How much do you got left in there? Let me see. Uh, maybe just a couple more and then be done. Maybe the top, that's what I was going to say right there. Perfect. Yeah, that's beautiful. All right, and then your list, your next thing says your beans. So your beans, you just want to accent it. It doesn't have to be piled with beans. It's just to give it that whole barbecue feel. Oh, move your hand closer so you don't have to clean the stove. Turn your handle there, dude. Perfect. Yeah, that looks great. That looks great. Just kind of get it all over and yeah, spread it out a little bit. Looks good. I can't wait to try it. Okay, what's next? Um, so next for you pineapple. is the pineapple. You're gonna use that fancy super de duper tool Noah said to buy. Tool that Noah said to buy. So I would mm. use, I would do beans on the top. 
And maybe kind of spread them. Or, yeah, I, I would, I would add more apples. beans. Do you want me to just put it in here? Because we can, we can eat beans no. with the side. What, honey? No, I got you a bowl. All right, I'm going to flip here for a second for Izzy. Oh wait, hold on a second. I want to show. I want to show them the tools. So hold on. I'll have you do the cheese, and then I'm gonna show them the tool. Where's right, my ahead, tool? Put cheese on. It's on the other side of your bowl, that. there, dude. Hold on, just a second, Izzy. I want everybody to see. Actually, if you move over a little bit, switch places with the bowl, it'll show you. I'm, I'm done. There we go. Perfect. All right, go ahead. You know, Dad, when he did it, he did it too far and it made a hole in the bottom. So take your cheese now and just kind of, like, take your hands and just kind of try and squish the thing a Not little squish, bit. but like, let me show you. Did you go all the way down? Pineapple! Stop it, please. Oh, goodness. All right, so you're Look cut. how fast I cut that. No, it's amazing. Absolutely amazing. Oh, this is your bowl for you getting her done. You watch me cut it, so you can't say it's amazing. Actually, I did. They watched it. No, they didn't. They did, too. And watch me cut it. How'd I okay, cut it? Okay, so Watch's Noah. Feeling. Wait, wait. That doesn't go on. That's the top. Okay, so now we're back. So you're we're back. So it says next on your list, you put down barbecue sauce. How do you put barbecue sauce? Yeah, it says another layer of barbecue sauce so the top's not dry, I think. Maybe just a little bit so the cheese doesn't melt to the top. So maybe go right down the middle with it, with that scoop right down the middle. And then maybe you could get like a, a, a butter knife or something and spread it out. Because you don't want a ton on there. I mean, you can kind of see, but a butter knife might help. Because it's all, I wouldn't do that. I would just listen to mom and I get a butter knife and spread it. Okay. All right, so now... You're gonna put the top on it. You're gonna put the top on it. Now I that turned so it on you, so. Cut. Yeah. Beautiful. Get the top on the other one. And that's the edge. Yep, there you go, perfect. All right, oh my goodness, that looks so beautiful. All right, so now for your mix, it was, um, <laughs> okay, so for your mix, you melted your butter. So why don't you bring it over here so they can see it? Where? Bring bring everything over here, right yeah. there. So and you know, Izzy, move. You ever trying to get his stuff done? You ever risk it? Isabella, we're it? starving. Back it up, back it up. Stop it. Okay, so now he's gonna add his. Um, hold on a second. Get your mustard. Get your mustard. Get your mustard. Mustard. Or, or. Get right at the top of the watermelon, the bowl. No. no. Okay. So you I got, got your. Oh so my many. goodness! Please. Okay. Are you ready? Okay. So go ahead. So he's gonna add his tablespoon of parsley. No, no. To your butter, dude. To your butter. And then you're gonna do a squeeze of that mustard. Probably it's gonna be about a tablespoon. So squeeze it in. I'll tell you. Squeeze. Perfect. Now you're going to stir it up. You're going to need a brush to stir it up. Now, if you use one more of those little tiny plastic knives, mom's going to freak right out. Oh, you're It'll wrong. work. It'll work. Look. Oh, you're terrible. You're terrible. It's terrible. Cardi B, if you're watching this, please tag us in it. Mr. Why would Cardi B tag you in it? Because she's clean. Okay, is it mixed? All right, so now you're gonna take it and you're gonna brush it on, and then when you get done doing that, you're gonna sprinkle the sesame seeds on it. And then we're gonna bake it at 350 for about 30 minutes. Beautiful. That looks, I can't even tell you how good that looks. Super yummy. All right, so I'll we'll have you finish that. Bet you I can predict what getting to the when we get home. All right, finish up that. Let's predict after. Stop it, Izzy. All right, I so Isabella, get your bowl. bowl. You're gonna add your cream cheese, your um, your cream cheese, your Jello thing, and your creamer. So you need a cup of creamer. That might be a little too big of a bowl, but I don't hey, know. Hey, I didn't even cut my bananas. You know what? I'm yet. kind of thinking with as much fruit as I you have. I didn't even cut my bananas yet. Bananas, you gotta soak them in juice. It has to be soaked in lime juice or lemon juice. juice. All right, now sprinkle with your sesame seeds. You're done. Go for it. I can't. 
Put them in your hand then. Dump them in your hand. Okay. I'm cutting these. Dump them in your hand. There you go. It doesn't have to be a lot. You're, you're... Dump them in your hand and do this with your hand. There you go. Perfect. Straight you got one straight line of sesame seeds, whatever. I hope somebody likes sesame seeds. Come on, dude. Mom, it's raining. On your fingers. Mom, it's raining. Can we go get popcorn? Okay. What? Mom, it's raining. It's popcorn time. All right. You guys have got to be the slowest cooks in the world. Well, guess what? We You're can be running on, on my dish. Maybe. You're running on my dish. Okay, so she's going to cut those up and my put them in the lime juice. Am I like take a timeout? You can take a timeout. Go for it. You got to move. Stop it. All this has to be moved out of the way so you can make your dessert one. So I would put, um, no, no. It has to be like out of the way. So I'd like you to put a lid on that, get it in the fridge. Put a lid on the onion, get in the fridge. Put that all in the fridge outside. Get your barbecue stuff cleaned up, and then you can start your um, your dessert one. All right. Cake five. Do you want juice in there? First, you're gonna get your cream cheese. It says I I bring your list over. So cheese. cream cheese. Lots. A crust. Chunk. And now you're going to beat, beat the it. cream cheese. Until it's light and creamy. I mean, this is watching you. Go ahead and tell them how it is. Is it good? It's busting. Yeah. Okay. Do I need this anymore? Nope. Now she's done trying it. Now all you do is dump all your fruit in it. Can I do one at a time and mix this with the Nope. Time? You put it all in and mix. Take your time. It's okay. Don't, I mean, you're to the, and then you fold it. Is that, you know what I mean by folding it? Yes. I can't see any of that fruit going in, but that's okay. So you want to fold it in because you don't want to break up the fruit. Show him the last stuff that he's going to start. I made this. It's beautiful. It's so beautiful. Okay, now he's going to start the marshmallow Where's fluff the peanut lids? butter. Yep. Um, are they in these other two drawers or just maybe wrap it in tin foil? I don't know. I might just put this just right now. Okay, now you're going to start your next dessert, which is your marshmallow fluff. So Noah fluff. is now going to be doing the marshmallow fluff one. So I would put it all in the... There you go. Put it like maybe toward the middle. It's easier, it's so much easier to spread out than in. You know what I'm saying? That looks beautiful. All right, and then try that. Yeah, and spread that out. And always go out. Yeah, push it out. Yeah, because see how you're gonna get crumbs? I would just keep pushing it out to the edges. Yeah, there you go. Go in and out. Yep, beautiful. You had to melt the peanut butter. All right, go ahead. I would be very careful when you put it on. <laughs> don't use your knife, just use your, don't so use your knife, you don't need a knife. pour it in the middle? Yeah, pour it in the middle like you did the Nutella. Oh, that's so, lift it a little bit, you're getting real. I just keep going, get more in there. Go toward the middle a little bit more, it's gonna go off your bread. Okay, perfect, that looks like it's gonna be plenty. All right, now go ahead and Spread to the side, side, yep, and then the side. And always start at the middle. Okay, it check your marshmallow fluff, it's gonna go fast. Cause it's already melted. Started coming out of the jug, didn't it? No, yeah it did. All right, so go ahead and put, do the same concept as we did before, right in the middle. Yeah, squeeze it out with your hand too. Right in the middle. Oh, it's still squeeze it, honey. Squeeze, put up, puff, chip, puff, squeeze. I'd get it all out. Just take cream, it all out. Cream, cream recipes. 
back and forth to spread it. Little, there you go. Yeah, beautiful. Just be patient with it, it'll move over. And you know what too, when we put our rolls on, you can squish it too. Do you know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Chocolate chips. And then get chocolate us. chips and then put your lid on. All right, thanks, Haley. No, you won't. She yeah, has a eight. chiropractor appointment, and then she's going to Josh you up from work. Six feet and one. Layer up, dude. Layer it up. There you go. Fill it up. Mr. Beast, we can make one of these. Corners. Bigger. Don't forget your corners. Mr. Beast. See the corner by your closest to you? Mr. Beast, can you tie us in this so we can make this with you? We're supposed to. All right, that's perfect. Now you're going to put the top on it. Go ahead, top. I got your butter melting right now. Make sure it's perfect to start because, yeah, you're not going to be able to shift it. Oh, huh? Make it perfect. Just a little bit. And then you're going to brush it on like you brushed on your other side. Just a little bit. Perfect. Mix it all. Keep, mix, mix. Maybe some butter's not melted, that's okay. Is it mixed? All right, so now you're going to Make brush it, it all over the top of your slider roll. And then I'm gonna get your oven going for you. Chris, I know you like this. Who is Chris? You know Chris. You got chocolate on your lips. Right here on top. You're probably licking the spoon. <laughs> that looks great. That looks great. And you're going to put it in the oven. 350 again for a little bit. No, don't do it. Get the sides though a little bit. Up here by the camera. Up here. Yeah. You're dripping. Man, you're dripping. Okay, perfect. All right, now let's stick it in the stove. Stick the drip. When it gets done, we will be back. Go for it, dude. I'm not cleaning the stove. I'll clean the marshmallow mess. Sheesh. Mr. Beast. Mr. Beast. Mr. Beast is a beast, a beast. Mr. Beast. You better do it this video. I like your Willy Wonka Tractor Factory video. Bye, Mr. Beast. Finished it. Um, it looked, it turned out good. I think we put a little too, too much, much marshmallow pop. fluff on it, but I mean, they're nice and crispy on the top. Um, I think it's going to be good. What do you think? Yeah. So we got his pulled pork and his marshmallow fluff sliders. Can't wait to try them. Yum me.